My name is Rosa, and I'm here to share a piece of my life with you guys. I realized I can use social media in a way to speak my mind and inspire other people that are going through the same thing as me or similar. Two past years have been the worst, but that doesn't stop me from smiling, from laughing, from living my life. My mom is so amazing. She does so much for me, and I hope she knows how much I appreciate her. And if I could ever pay her back for everything she's done for me, I would do it without even thinking it twice. I wish somebody told me as a kid that life gets tough, that all these things can happen, that anybody could get sick, that life can just hit you so hard to the point where you just want to give up. I wish somebody told me that. I wasn't ready for all this. I didn't know all this. And I'm just grateful for the family that God gave me because they make me a better me and they make me strong. And sometimes I just want to give up and not take my pills ever again because I hate that it has side effects and that I can't go out with my friends because I always feel sick. I hate losing weight and it makes me just feel really down. But at the end of the day, I always pick myself up and I remember the strong girl I am. My mom always has a big smile on her face, even when we're at the doctor's appointment because we always want to receive good news and we expect good news. And sometimes it's not like that, but we still go with a positive mindset. Just because I got a smile on my face doesn't mean I don't go through anything. So despite all the, what we talked about, it seems like you have, how do you feel like your self-esteem is like, like, what do you mean? Like, you know, like self-esteem, like you feel good about yourself, you um, happy about yourself. Well, sometimes I feel happy about myself, but sometimes because of like the disorder mm -hmm. and everything like that went on, um, I feel like sad. Like I know there's like a piece of me that's like sad. Like I try to stay positive and like like show everybody that I can that I could do it, but I know deep down like I'm sad. And then what about um, when you described to me right now the dizziness? The of the spots, the huge headaches. Does that happen like once a week or? That happens like twice a week. Twice a week? Yeah. That's a long time. Yeah. How do you handle that? Well, I try to like, I try to think positive and I just try to stay strong and like, I just feel like, like it's gonna like go, I'm gonna get cured one day and it's just like happening in the moment, but like my life is not over yet and I could still get through it. So that's like basically how I always think. Mm 